It's science time. This weekend, I had a Sprite at my birthday party, and that got me thinking, where do all these bubbles come from? So let's figure it out. This is not a test. Repeat, this is not a test. Stay tuned for further instructions. Okay kids, this is the part where we say, don't do any of our science experiments without the supervision of your parents, period. These types of experiments are quickly becoming some of our favorites because Woodrow and I can find the ingredients we need to do some pretty killer science experiments. First, you're gonna wanna make sure so you can avoid making a giant mess, a glass baking pan, or even a cookie sheet, and as many glasses as you can line up in that cooking dish. Then, you're gonna wanna get Pure baking soda, white vinegar, and some food coloring. First, pour some baking soda in each glass. Now we need different colored drops of food coloring into each glass. Now, you need the special vinegar. That's white. Mom, can you help me open this? Please. Thank you. And let's pour it in until it gets crazy. Can I touch them? Yeah. What? It's mixing, mixing in. Oh, let's see what I mix it in with. Oh, it's all there. What? Did you see that, guys? That was awesome, right? Now let's talk about the science behind it. Bicarbonate of soda, or baking soda, is a compound of sodium, hydrogen, carbon, and oxygen. These compounds break up when they come in contact with vinegar. The carbon and oxygen separate to form a gas called carbon dioxide. That's the same bubbles in soda. What's your favorite soda? Mine is Sprite. But listen guys, thank you so much for watching my science videos. Make sure to subscribe for this channel and watch my science videos every week. I just love science so much.